happy to be here with all of you this afternoon. My name is May and I'm honored to be a part of the Fleming Artists Festival and to be working with such wonderful people at Fleming Artists. I love them all dearly and this is a really sweet day and tomorrow's going to be wonderful too. I'm up here in Traverse City and just got done with a run in the mud and um, just want to sing some songs for you this afternoon, feeling you all in this time that we're all going through. So I'm going to start with a love song and I want to dedicate it to anyone who is missing or longing to be with someone that they can't right now. And uh, there's a lot of ways to feel and share love and so this is a song about not being afraid to do that. It's called Closer to Me. This next song just feels like spring is in the air today. The sun is out, and we still probably got snow coming, but uh, 
really relish in these moments in the sunshine. And so I had a few people today uh, send me messages singing this song. And so it's been, it's been in, on my heart in the welcoming of spring. And it's a Michigan song that I wrote about the rivers in the UP. There's so much precious fresh water here. And so I'm gonna sing this one and invite you all to sing along. And if you're listening from anywhere outside, celebrating that mother nature with all of you. This is called the River Jordan. grateful to everyone at Fleming for putting out all the work into making this happen, creating this online festival. It's been so nice to feel connected today and uh, can't say enough about the team at Fleming. And if you feel inclined, there's a, a lot of ways to donate on the website and in the description as well. And all the donations are going directly to the artists um, during this time. And so uh, thank you for that. So I, this song came to mind today. Um, I was reading, I've been reading lots of articles. I know everybody's reading and there's a lot of anxiety people are feeling. And I 
I think it's hard to hold space for it. And I've been realizing that there's a subconscious anxiety happening that I'm not necessarily totally aware of until the nighttime comes. And then it's like, oh, wow, okay. Um, and so this is a kind of a, a sad song, a grieving song. And it's a quiet song. And it's sort of about making room in the daylight uh, to honor our grief. And it's called Paint the Town. Sorrow's been my love I'm leaving her tonight We talked under the covers Until it felt alright It's alright She could feel She was happy being lonely She was happy there with me So we told a story That everyone believed mm -hmm. He said joy is just too easy Thanks. Thanks.
thanks for tuning in. Thanks for being a part of Fleming Fest, everyone. So grateful you're here. Nice to see you there. I'm gonna move over to this piano here. So fun getting to just play in my living room like I normally do. But I miss seeing all your beautiful faces in real life. And uh, grateful for all these ways we can connect. And grateful uh, to everybody who put a lot of work into this. Um, ben walked me through how to do this this morning and he was so helpful. Thank you, Ben, so much. So I'm going to sing you a song. You know, there's a lot of, of things around being um, fitting inside of a box that somebody makes for us. Uh, a lot of labels in our society of ways that we should be. And it's really hard because um, we're a lot more than, than that. And so I was having a day where I felt like I was just falling short in all of those categories of the boxes I had created or that other people had created for me. And it was a weird day and I, one thing after another, I got kicked out of a town I was uh, very scrutinized at a show that I played for two people and a couple other failures and uh, I was just having a sad day and so I went to the store and I said I'm just gonna get a head of broccoli and I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna have my sad broccoli and I'm gonna put an end to this day and then tomorrow is gonna be another thing. So I'm in line and the line at the store is long and I'm waiting and kind of looking around like what's going on here and at the front of the line there was this very small beautiful very elderly woman and she had all of these like bags that she had brought and she was like they were like billowing all over the place and uh, it was really kind of confusing what she was trying to do and she was holding up the line the line was getting longer and the cashier was this very young woman probably like 19 years old so she's feeling the pressure of the line, but wanting to respect this elder, and she didn't quite know how to handle it socially. And so she, uh, she finally says, excuse me, ma'am, um, is something wrong? And then this little old lady shoots up like straight as an arrow, and she says, there's nothing wrong with me. There's something right with me. And I just about lost it. And we were all like, yes, ma'am. And so she inspired, that beautiful woman inspired the song that I'm about to sing for you. And it's on the new Sweetwater Warbler record that will be out in May. And we just released a new single um, yesterday and it's called Mother's Voice. And so please go check it out. We're really excited about the record. Um, but this is a song called Write With Me. So I've been waiting for the 
glad you guys like the stories. I'm grateful for that. I like telling them. Um, I'm going to sing a song about the light that comes from sharing our pain. And I had a, a teacher once, and she told me that, you know, it's not like we have joy over here and sorrow over here. It's really that they're right here, and we just kind of move between them as we do. And so we don't have to just feel one thing. It's kind of all of it. And we kind of sway back and forth. And that it's okay, even when we're really struggling, it's okay to still feel joy. And also, same goes the other way around. And I have found that through sharing some of my deepest vulnerabilities, struggles, pain, frustrations, it has allowed me to, to really feel connected with other humans and that vulnerability. And so this is a song about the brightness and the brilliance that comes from sharing those things. And it's called The Light at the End. you one more song and then I'm gonna pass it over um, Tony Caldor is next and there's so many great musicians today and tomorrow uh, so please keep tuning in and if you feel moved to make a donation all the donations are going to the artists and we're so grateful uh, but really thank you for listening grateful you're here it's so wonderful to feel you all and to connect um, I want to leave you with a sing-along and encourage you to lift your voices up at home uh, with me. And this is a time where I was talking about earlier that anxiety and the fear is just so easy to succumb to and it's becoming like a partner in the day sometimes. And I've just always noticed that when I'm acting out of fear, 
that my actions are so feeble. And as we all move through this with very, very different realities right now, um, for some people, this is a lot easier than for others. Um, and so we all just have to have a lot of love and a lot of patience and courage as a people. And so I want to dedicate this song to that courageous part of you that lives in love. And I want to thank you for sharing your love with me today. And I'll teach you this one if you haven't heard it before. I'll say, mm, I'll say, I won't be afraid. And you say, oh no. And I'll say, afraid to fall. You say, do fall. I'd rather be bold.
so much. Connie Caldor is up next. Love you all. Thank you for listening. Take care and be well. Thank you so much to the whole Fleming team. Love you all. Have a great rest of your Saturday. Thanks.